We are back. This time I am going to open 165 of the Player's Choice crates. Uh, I gotta warn you, I am sick. I've had a cold the last couple of days. You know, I'm not contagious, at least not from this distance. Um, but yeah, my throat's kind of bothering me, my sinuses are killing me, so I'm gonna try to make it through this video without wanting to stop it, which I was never intending on recording this, but I thought, man, if I'm about to open 165 of these bad boys, you're darn well right, I'm going to record it. A couple things I wanted to bring up was the new decals. There's five decals in the new crate. They can come in painted variants, which this is new. And it'll be interesting to see if they go back and retrofit any of the old decals. What it effectively does, though, is it gives you three colors to play with uh, as you can see like this is lime this is the only one i have right now that's painted but you see it's lime here lime here this is a very interesting idea i think uh, i think it's going to open up a lot more car color combinations uh, as time goes by especially if they do add more this is the super rxt rear decal um as well with this you know update obviously the new hot wheel stuff came out i really like these you know maybe it's also because I grew up with, you know, it was, it was Hot Wheels and Legos when I was growing up if I wasn't riding my bike outside. Um, so this is really cool. I, I like this one because it kind of reminds me of the Backfire. It's got that old hot rod look to it. I think it looks great with rat rods. Um, actually, this antenna is free, I think, with this update. So, uh, and these wheels right here are one of the wheels that comes with one car or the other. I don't remember which goes with which. But just, I don't know, it's different. It's neat. I would assume that this is not the only time we're going to see this, that this deal with Hot Wheels could actually lead to more cars in the future, which I think would be pretty neat. Um, this one, though, I love. My son actually has this car. Uh, I think we probably got it from a thrift store or something a long time ago when he was younger. Uh, he's uh, 11 now, almost 12. So the fact that we found this in his box of Hot Wheels was really, really cool. Um, I love the toppers, like the shark one. I love this antenna, this topper right here. They're all free, obviously, with the, the update. But I really like this one. I think it's pretty neat. It sounds good. The engine sounds really nice. Um, but another thing that's interesting about this car, I don't know if it's been tested yet since it's, you know, the, this just came out a couple days ago. Or Wow, today's Wednesday. Uh, it came out yesterday. <laughs> I don't feel good. Um, this one supposedly is supposed to be identical to the Batmobile in terms of hitbox, turning radius, and all that good stuff. So I think that's great that we get another choice. Um, you know, because the Batmobile does seem to be getting more popular, so it's nice that we get another car. Um, the only thing I'll say about that, though, this Hotmobile here, the... <laughs> I don't know why I just said that. Um, the Twin Mill... Three, um, now I'm going to start calling it the Hotmobile from here on out. This is the Hotmobile. Learn it. Love it. Live it, people. Join me in calling it the wrong name. Um, the only problem I have, and I mean, I guess you could say the same for the Dominus, because I don't think there's one into the game. Uh, the fact that basically to have those Batmobile stats, you have to buy a car. It would be... Just, I think, great if they would rework something like the Paladin. Um, if they did it kind of like they did the Hot Shot, you know, upgrade the look of it at some point. Redo the, this car in particular uh, and make it like the Batmobile. So that way you get a Batmobile type car, like the statistics wise, with the base game. You don't have to go buy something to have that car. Um, I also, I love the Paladin because it was the first car I ever used. I used it for quite a while before I moved on to something different. So there's kind of like a special place in my heart for it. And it really disappoints me that no one uses this car anymore. Um, so I would love to see them at some point rework this. I think the Batmobile stats on it would be just perfect. Um, and it would actually give it, you know, some much deserved and needed love. <clears throat> but this car otherwise, yeah, I really like this Hotmobile. Uh, the Twin Mark III. The other one is also really cool. But let's move on to opening some crates. Another thing that threw me off was I went to go look for the first crate I had. You know, I got my C1, C2, C3, C4s, and I'm like, hey, where's my, hey, where's my crate? 
Oh, it's in alphabetical order. Duh. It's called the player's choice crate. So, here's your five decals. All five of these can come in painted variants. Like I said, I think this Dominus GT Unmasked will probably look really cool with painted variants. I saw a picture of one on Reddit. Uh, it was like four screen. Really, really cool. Um, I mean, I, I just love the idea of that extra color uh, combo. So I think that could open up some stuff. You got these distortions. I'm kind of surprised they didn't add the X-Devil distortion. You know, go ahead and just do five. There's five different cars here. Do the five down here. Of course, you get the Dom GT, Breakout Type S, Octane. The Lightnings have been rebranded the Voltaics. I don't know if that was a bug. Uh... If there was confusion around the boost in the wheels, which I don't see how you could get confused about those two things, but these are now the Volts. Uh, Zombas, of course, and then no new black market decal this time. It's just the same ones we've already had, but, you know, I guess it would suck if they took those out as an option. Um, so let's go ahead and get started, because, uh, yeah, I'm starting not to feel very good. Yes. Ding, 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 Let me drink some more juice real quick. Uh. <clears throat> the Cobra. Um, another interesting thing, um, just the plain Cobra, is the fact that I'm using NVIDIA Share to record this right now. And I've noticed that the in-game audio, even if I have the darn thing cranked up as high as it'll go, is fairly low in comparison to what I hear and what my mic volume is. Tribal. Um. Oh! Painted! What is it? It looks like it's, uh, is that crimson? Nice! Yes, I'm a little excited. You know, second crate got a painted. And it's certified! Holy crap! All right, then. Not too shabby. I can't complain. Let's move on. Um, but yeah, the the Nvidia Share. I'm. I don't know what the deal is with the in-game audio being kind of low. Um, I'm kind of hoping that the. This is the one I already had that was lime that I was showing y'all earlier. Holy moly! Painted. Uh, looks like it's gray, maybe. Man, I wonder if they upped the chance of painted items on these bad boys. Uh, let's... Round three. Fight! Um, <laughs> and I'm sorry if I'm being silly. Uh, I don't even... <laughs> I'm not even medicated right now. I don't feel well, and that's my only excuse. I have no meds in me. Because um, I didn't want to cause issues with sleeping later. Um... Alright, this is starting to get weird. The fact that this is now... Is this normal? Like, are these supposed to be painted so often? This is starting to get a little weird. Hold on. Let's go back real quick. Something doesn't seem right. Is this crap bugged or something? Wait, what car was that? Uh, let's... Let me not mess up my presets. Uh, create a new preset. And sorry, bear with me just for one second, guys. I'm trying to figure out, am I going crazy? Yeah, this one's crimson. Okay, maybe they come painted really easily. Um, I didn't, wasn't expecting this at all. Uh, so this is kind of a nice little surprise if this is going to be typical. Yeah, I'll probably find it was bugged and I was about to get a crap ton of painted items and I just ruined it by exiting out of the screen. I'll be crying later. they like, no! Where are my painted? Where am I? My uh, certified... Alright, so we got here the Octane ZSR. I already have that. Always can use another. Love this car. <clears throat> um, at some point, I am seriously thinking of doing a, a Reddit giveaway, probably around spring break, maybe right beforehand, giving away some of the Hot Wheels uh, DLC. Um, Breakout Type S! If anybody knows who I am on Reddit, uh, I actually did a giveaway during Christmas time where I basically almost like every day, every other day during the month of December up until December 24th, I gave away DLC for the game. You know, I picked stuff at random. Um, you know, I did buy it on sale when it was like Black Friday or something, but I, I bought a whole bunch of it with the intention of giving it all away. 
And then on the 24th, the last day, I gave away 63 DLC. I gave a minimum of each different DLC. I gave away three of each. I think I gave away 10 of the Vulcans just because that was like the most popular thing that people wanted. Um, a couple of the things like the Marauder, the Proteus, the Triton. I'm looking at a list right now. The NBA Flag Pack. Nobody voted on it. It was such a shame. Another breakout. Um, so basically everybody won on those. I was doing like, hey, give me a number between 1 and 1,000 kind of a thing. And only like three people wanted the NBA Flag Pack. I was only giving away three of them. So it was like, everybody's a winner. <clears throat> Anyway, uh, but yeah, I'm thinking about Certified Zombas, nice. Um, probably right before spring break, uh, maybe the weekend before. Uh, well, I guess that would be kind of the start of spring break, wouldn't it? Uh, I will probably do a giveaway for, I'm thinking the Hot Wheels stuff would be kind of neat. Um, we'll see. I mean, I may do some other stuff too, but that was what I was really thinking. Uh-oh, it wasn't painted, wasn't certified. I'm starting to get worried that I had some sort of a funky bug, that I just broke it. That's going to be disappointing. But, oh well, at least I got a couple of cool things out of it. Um, But yeah, maybe maybe say something in the comments if y'all would be interested in me doing a... I'd probably do it over Reddit like I did before, because it's easier to manage that way. Um, If y'all want me to do something like that, let me know. <clears throat> I'm not going to talk as much now because my throat is starting to hurt. Um, only other thing I'll mention is I don't see how the guys that open up like a lot more crates than this or back when I played Hearthstone and was opening packs and stuff. Uh, I never recorded any of that, but I'd open some and I thought, man, like these guys that get on here and open just so many things where it's like, you know, a nine hour stream of them doing nothing but opening Bless those people. You know, I I have even been entertained by watching some of that stuff, but God, it gets boring after a while. Or, you know, your hand starts to hurt. So you really kind of got to give it to those folks for doing stuff like that. Um, Uh-oh. Starting to get unlucky here. Maybe, maybe I did hit some sort of a weird bug, because I got like, what was that, three things? Fairly quick, all painted. Um, come on. Another distortion. I don't need another distortion. And I, I may give some of this stuff away, too. Uh, I will be honest. The main reason I did DLC instead of items in the game. DLC is easy. As long as we get added to each other's Steam's accounts. Doesn't matter if you're online at the same time as me or not. I can gift it to you anytime. Uh, I can gift it from my phone, even. Uh, which is what I was doing a lot. Because it was Christmas holidays. I was busy. Um... Eh, nothing special. Um, so that's why I prefer giving away DLC. Uh, giving away items kind of sucks just because, yeah, then you actually have to kind of schedule it, plan to be in the game at the same time. A lot of the people who got involved in the DLC giveaways were not even in this region, so that makes it even harder uh, because, you know, timing conflicts and scheduling and stuff like that. Uh, G giving away in-game items would just, yeah, it seems like it'd be a nightmare. I if I were going to do that, I'd almost want to see if I could find, like, a middleman who would be interested in getting involved to let him give away the items. You know, like, I'll just hand them all over. Oh, certified. Maybe I'm being stupid, but why don't they say what the certification is on this screen right here? You would think they would do that. Um... Unless I'm missing something, maybe there's like a hot key to bring it up on the screen or something. I don't think so. <clears throat> but yeah, if I do the items, probably get somebody else involved, uh, like a, a middleman or somebody that's trusted on Reddit or something, uh, just because I don't want to deal with it, basically. Uh, the timing on that would be kind of a nightmare. Like I said, the DLC, when I gave away all that stuff at Christmas, that was a lot more time-consuming than I thought it would be. And that was as simple as all you had to do was add me to, on Steam, and that's it. Um, but a lot of people waited, you know, days before they would add me, and I was trying to get people to confirm that they received things before I moved on. So, we shall see. Let's see what we got here. I want some more of those regular painted decals. Come on. 
<clears throat> Let's see what we got. Ah, another breakout type of. If I keep getting a lot of these cars, yes, I probably will need to give some of this stuff away. Um, I didn't think about that. I think the cars are all uh, this red level. I think what with the boost, maybe also on that same tier before. So yeah, now the cars are going to be a lot more common, I guess. Um, I think I don't remember which one was which. I'm also probably going to take some of these, obviously, and like, you know, use the in-game system to upgrade them. But uh, depending on how much I have in, at the end of this, I would consider, yes, giving away some of the cars for sure. Uh, maybe some of the wheels that I get extra. Um, I just need to find somebody on Reddit, like I said. Which I have a few of the, the middlemen on there. I just don't know if they do that. Um, Oh man, this is starting to get lame, guys. What's up with this? Give me some more of my goodies. Where are my, my painted decals? <clears throat> um, yeah, I don't feel good. I'm not going to talk as much. I was going to wait to do this, but I really wanted to open these crates and get it over with. So, so it is what it is. <clears throat> um, it'll be interesting to see if the new season will end up bringing like a, a CC5 crate. Um, I, I'm really wondering when they're actually going to get rid of some of the older crates, like the CC1s and 2s, and maybe the 3s and 4s, uh, and then introduce something new. Wow, okay, I really am starting to think I must have gotten either extremely lucky, or I did hit some sort of a weird bug when I first came into this. Um... Because, I mean, what are the odds that, like, the first three or four crates I opened were all painted? I think maybe they were all certified. I can't remember. <clears throat> Nothing. And as much as I love this animation, just kind of like with Hearthstone, man, give me a way to just burn through it. You know, like, obviously the computer knows what I'm going to get on the back end immediately, probably. Just... Just get to it. When I push the button, show me what I got. So, um... Because even for people that don't buy crates all the time, you know, maybe only got a couple crates while they're playing and only get to open a few, after the first couple of times, this is... I think it's no longer needed to see the opening. Uh, this little spinning wheel. Um, I used to complain about the same thing in uh, Hearthstone, I guess I should say, not Hearthstone. Um... The fact that, yeah, you'd sit there and most of what you're waiting on was like an animation of the card pack kind of opening and stuff. So I wish they would allow, like, in the option somewhere to say, no, just just open it. <clears throat> Get it over with. I'm mainly saying that now because I don't feel good. <laughs> and holy crap, I still got a long way to go. I'm only at 137. I'm not going to make it, guys. And this is going to be a much longer video than I would want it to be, too. Um, doesn't help that I started by talking about other stuff. Let's see what we got here. I wish there's like a hotkey combo that I can push to get through this a little faster. Uh, my kids are going to be home soon from track practice. I didn't go to work today, by the way. Um... That's how bad I felt this morning. I felt like somebody had taken a brick and smashed the right side of my face with it. Painted! Sup, sup! Looks like uh, saffron. Not bad. I'll take it. Um, but yeah, I mean, I didn't feel good. I left work a couple hours early yesterday. Then I took today off. That's how bad I feel. I mean... It sucks. Normally the only time I take off is if like one of my kids is sick, at least when they were younger. Um, you know, now my daughter can stay home by herself. But, but yeah. And you know what's really funny? He's like, if one of my kids were sick, and they probably had what I have, I'd be all like, suck it up, get up, it's time to go to school. <laughs> you know, if it's me, I'm like, no, fuck that noise. I'm staying home. <laughs> Cause I don't feel good. This sucks. 
Um, cause I, I get a cold like once every other year, uh, half the time it's usually from my wife or my kids or something. They're the ones that give me, you know, whatever it is I may get this time. It's all me. It really sucks. And I know I'm talking a, a lot about being sick, so, but I have nothing else to talk about. So, like I said, if you don't want to hear it, just mute me. I probably sound a little weird, too. Anyway, my voice, I'm sure, sounds a little bit off. <clears throat> you know, I'm sure some of you are like, Don't worry, you always sound weird. <laughs> and I'm kind of giggly right now for some reason, which, like I said, I haven't had any meds. I haven't had, you know, anything that should make me act differently. I don't usually drink pretty much ever. So it's kind of odd that I just want to laugh right now. Certified! This guy right here, he's certifiable! Yeah, I'm gonna drink some orange juice. Come on, painted voltaic! All right, disappointment sets in. Come on, baby, give me something good. Unmasked, come on, give me painted, give me painted. Come on, come on. Boom shakalaka, called it. What is that, sky blue? Nice. Daddy likes. So I, I'm thinking that the the chance of painted decals must be much higher than the normal, typical, like painted wheels and stuff. Uh, which is very nice if they did that, because yeah, that's a lot to collect if you were trying to get all of them. Or even, you know, you wanted a specific one. Um, and that means that the market will actually have a lot probably in the next week or so. Because, uh, you know, a lot of people are opening them with keys that aren't tradable yet, so then you can have to wait that seven day or six day period before you can trade them. But I figure in like a week, bam, these things are going to be flooding the market, all these painted variants, which will be nice. Um, well, let's see. Nothing. Sorry, I'm texting my daughter right now. <coughs> uh, plane, alright. Sorry if I'm not making this as exciting as, like, people who do this for a living, like the YouTuber guys. Um, I did turn on, like, the modernization or whatever the... See how that worked. I turned it back off on one of my original videos, um, just because I was curious what it was like. But I don't foresee me ever actually doing this stuff to make money. I mean, I have a job uh, that I'm happy with, and you know, have retirement plans and all that good stuff when I get older. So yeah, I don't ever see me wanting to be a YouTuber. I think that's. I think it's probably a younger person's game anyway. Uh, it's my personal opinion. But, uh, you know, I could be like an older YouTuber. I remember I saw that, uh, who's the, there's this older lady. She's like in her 70s, I think, and she plays video games. That is just awesome. Because, you know, she's probably older, retired. Yes! Painted! Orange, it looks like. Nice. Even though I never use this car, Dagnabbit. <laughs> Give me more of the uh, the tribals, and maybe like the uh, the unmasked are the two that I would want the most probably. I'd take some funny books too. <laughs> Who am I kidding? I'll take anything I can get. <clears throat> but no, the old uh, old grandma lady. Um, I cannot think of what her YouTube channel is, but I think that is just wonderful. I hope that when I get older, at that age, that I am playing video games. Um, I think that's just awesome, personally. Especially if, you know, she was already retired, I'm assuming and hoping. So she's just sitting there playing games and recording and talking. I think that's that's awesome. Um, I want that to be me, you know. I'll be sitting here, probably not playing Rocket League, but I'll be like, Back in my day, 
we'd get a distortion. And that's just the way it was. And, uh, oh, it came certified. Ah, oh, that's great. Let's move on. Oh, you know, and I had to walk five miles in the snow both ways. Did you have to end uphill both ways? Did you do that? No. I never did either, but... <clears throat> I don't know if that was a very good old man impersonation, but... BOOM! I can't tell what color that is. Is that orange, maybe, or crimson? It's too light. I can't see, but... Alright, so... Alright, yes. The painted decals must be... I'm wondering what the percentage chance is on it. Maybe, like, at least 25%, I would think. Which is very, very nice, if that is the case. Come on, Dom. GT Unmasked. Get me painted. Don't really care about cert. Paint. Yeah. Never mind. 118 to go. You know, just a few. We got this. No problem, bro. No problem. And a Dom GT. Maybe give me a cert. Maybe. Not that I'm really big into certs. And nothing. So if I had to guess, yes, I'm going to probably end up with several extra cars. I already had some extra cars anyway. Um, so I can easily see me doing a Reddit giveaway when all of this is said and done. Uh, my kids are probably going to be home in a minute. Cert. So I will probably have to like walk away for a minute maybe. I don't know how exactly I'm going to do this. Um... <clears throat> Although it shouldn't take that much longer to finish the video, but I'm going to at least say hi to them. All that good stuff. And then uh, I'll finish this up. So I'll try to make it like 30 seconds. Nothing. We got another tribal. Come on, man. Give me some painted. Uh, like I said, though, as far as a giveaway... Do, do people do giveaways on YouTube? I don't know. You know, I maybe on Twitch? I don't know. Post in the comments if you want me to do it, period, if you if you guys are interested. Uh, I mean, if I do it on Reddit, it really won't matter. But if y'all, like, if people actually do it on YouTube or Twitch or something, let me know if that's, like, a common thing. Maybe I could just do it that way instead. Um, maybe point me to somebody else that's done it so I can see, like, how they did it. Because I've done it on Reddit, obviously, and that was easy enough. <clears throat> Man, I've only done 50 of these. <laughs> this is taking a little longer than I thought it would. You know, like I said, if it wasn't for this... If it wasn't for this stupid animation and its stupid dog, it wouldn't take this long. Uh, come on. Come on, give me painted. Come on. No. Have I got? I guess I haven't gotten a black market decal either yet. But those are pretty rare, I think. Funny book. Give me a painted one. Come on, come on. Yeah. Overall, I mean, I, I like the idea, I guess, of the player's choice crates. Uh, I mean, it'd be kind of nice if they do this in the future. I think it should kind of help with the whole Zomba and Voltaics. I want to keep calling them Lightnings uh, issue right now. I mean, like, I think those are going for way too much money. Um, I was looking at the, the prices on those. It seems like the Lightnings have finally kind of come back down. But in the, and like, what's up with the loopers? Like, those all of a sudden went up in price. And I'm like, why? Um, so, I'm not talking much about these just because I keep getting the same stuff over and over. It, but yeah, it's like, I don't know why the loopers kind of have gone out of control and some of the other wheels. Lightnings finally, especially the Crimsons, kind of came back down. They had gotten up there to like 60-something keys, I think, for n no certification, just plain like Crimson Lightnings. May have even gotten higher, for all I know. Um, but they've come back down to like 40s. Um, 
So I'm hoping that with this crate, now you've got potentially two crates on the market that have uh, lightnings in them and zombas. So hopefully that'll lower those down a bit more if more of them enter the market. <clears throat> Nothing. My dogs are barking like crazy, so that means my children might be home now. I'm assuming. And I'm probably making dinner tonight, too. You know, would you want a sick person making your food? I don't think so. So, but granted, at this point, since I've been sick for a couple of days, I'm pretty sure that anything contagious-wise was probably gone a day or so ago, I really hope. <clears throat> I have no idea why I felt so bad this morning, though. Even up until about 1 o'clock, I felt like dog poo. Speaking of dogs, not dog poo, man, you know, we've got three dogs and a cat. My dogs are so great. You know, they're, we got small dogs. Um, I kind of wish we had a bigger dog, but, uh, you know, it's like they can sense when you're sick. The cat don't care. She, she walks by, she's like, you're dead to me anyway. I mean, she's a great cat for a cat, but like, yeah, she's like... As long as you feed me and take care of my litter box, uh, yeah, whatever. Um, that's a real shame that you're sick. The dogs, man, they're all like, you know, we have one boy and two girls. He comes up and he's all patting me with his paw. And he's all, Daddy, are you okay, man? You know, that's my voice for my dog. But anyway, um, <laughs> I'm rambling now because I have nothing to talk about. All I'm doing is opening crate after crate after crate, and I have nothing to talk about, so y'all have to just just mute me if you don't want to hear me ramble. Man, no painted lightnings, no painted zombies. So if it the paintings, painted stuff is coming up more often, it's definitely on the new decals only. <clears throat> um, but yeah, it's like a dog can sense your emotional state what I was trying to say. Um, and I think some... What, what color is that? Uh, maybe burnt sienna? It's really hard to tell on this one what that extra color is. Because the dots are so tiny. Maybe if my, my background, or my main default color was something different, it would be easier to tell. <clears throat> um, come on, come on, come on, baby. Come on. Let's do it. Nothing. 98 to go. Wow, this video is going to be so much longer than I anticipated. I guess I really did not think about how long it takes for this little spinning wheel thing to go. Um, I mean, it's no big deal, I guess. I'm going to do them all, but nothing. What else we got? And let's see. Cobra. Nothing. And, you know, I'd be curious to know some of the people that post in the comments. Um, like, I'm not a great player. I've probably got, I don't know, I have to go look, 300 and something hours, 350 hours. Uh, although I am pretty bad about doing, like, AFK crap, too. So, I'd still say it's got to be over actual 300 hours played, I would think. Um... You know, now, if you were to look at my Skyrim hours played, no, that's a totally different story. I bet probably half the hours I had in that game were AFK games. Um, but anyway, my point was, is like, I'm 
depending on the day of the week and depending on which mode I'm doing, I'm anywhere from a rising star to a uh, probably all-star player. I don't know if I've ever hit superstar, maybe. I'm curious, like, what some other people are, because... Oh! Uh, is this another crimson? I think I already had this. Oh, well, I'll take it! <clears throat> the... I'm just, yeah, I'm curious, uh... What other people are at the same hours. Because, I mean, I've seen people who... Granted, when I play ranked, I don't take it too seriously. A lot of people get so upset. Don't! It's a game! Maybe it's because I'm older and I just don't care. Um, you know, I'll, I, I often will, like, you know, uh, whatever, shift tab out and look at that person's profile because I'm curious, like, man, this guy was really good. How many hours does he have? And I do see a lot of people in the star rankings that have, like, 800 to 1,000 plus hours. Um, so it, it does kind of make me wonder where I truly fall skill-wise. I think I'm pretty much average. Because, um, you know, I've, I have played against plenty of people that are in the 200-plus range that are at the same skill ranking as me. Um, and like I said, if it's some of those people with like a 1,000 hours, uh, I'm assuming they must play more like me where they... They don't take it that seriously. They're just like, eh, you know, if I win, lose, they don't really care. So, I mean, I try to do my best. Because if, if I'm playing with someone else, I'm not doing solo 1v1s. Um, you know, I don't want to let down the other person I'm with because I don't want them to derank because of me. Uh, and I'm definitely a much better team player, I think, than, let's say, a 1v1. 1v1, I'm only, like, rising or shooting in. Um, at least when I was actually playing. I haven't really played much lately. Uh, I guess because I've kind of been waiting for the next season to start. I gave up on trying to hit champion. <clears throat> I don't really have enough time to play to be able to put in the hours to get to that point. So I was just kind of like, man, I'm, I'm happy with the blue wheels and whatever else comes with it. Um, I ain't getting nothing. No certifications, no painteds, no nothing. Um, yeah, it just makes me curious what other people are getting out there in terms of... Uh, Hour count, how good you are, what's your rank. Uh, I would be happy to play with some people sometime uh, if you're in the stars. Um, it will be interesting to see if once the new season starts. Because I am seeing, that's the other reason I guess I haven't been playing as much. <sighs> and maybe it depends on the day of the week, like if it's on the weekend, when I, that's normally when I can play. It's like, you know, or after my kids are in bed. Um, Holy crap, there's a lot of Smurfs on. Uh, I'll get on, and, you know, there's somebody with, like, 20 hours. And they're using, I mean, you know, it doesn't help when their account's called Papa Smurf or something like that. Um, I don't really know how they can fix that problem. Uh, the Smurfs really have kind of gotten out of control. Uh, that's why I'm kind of like, come on, hurry up with the new season. Maybe they'll address some of it, I'm not sure. My only thing would be, and I mean, I hate to kind of be unfair... Uh, the only thing I can think is, don't allow people to do rank until they get to X level. Like, you know, make your account have to get to level 30 or 40. Uh, 40 is probably too high. 30, I think, might be a little more fair. Because um, 20 is too low. I think people can hit that way too quick. But the they, they should do something about it. I just don't know what the answer is. Um, because they can't... I don't think they could do any sort of IP logging to track, like, oh, you're the same guy that was on that account. That wouldn't necessarily be fair, because what if it's like my kid is logging in from a different, you know, different account, different profile, all that stuff. So, I, I, like I said, I don't know what the right answer is, but yeah, Smurfs have gotten a little out of control, I think. Um, and like I said, it totally seems to be dependent on maybe the day and time. Uh, it does seem to be... I've seen it more on the weekends or late evenings, but not too late. Uh, like, you know, 10, 11 o'clock. Eh. Where's the good stuff? Where's the, the painted? Um. And I wonder how long this thing's gonna be. This is gonna be like an hour long. So. I don't know if there's a way to do an easy summary at the end. <coughs> Not really, just because I've already got a lot of crap. Uh, 
Another distortion. And if I'm ever going to do this again, I obviously need to go watch somebody else's video to see if they talk about more interesting stuff than I'm talking about right now. Um, I know with Hearthstone, uh, like when one guy opened up a ton of packs, he didn't really talk much. He actually got very quiet in his video, at least after a while, because I think he was starting to get bored. Like I said, you know, bless those people who can stand doing this stuff for like hours and hours on the end. I would, I can't, I couldn't do it. There's no way. Nothing painted. <clears throat> oh, and somebody had commented um, about the toppers. They had asked me to do a video of all the toppers. I don't know if I will do that. Um, that would take a while. <laughs> I mean, I don't know if there's more wheels or toppers. Um, I might do it, like, one evening or on a weekend or something. Go through all of them. I mean, the, the problem with... And the same thing could be said about the wheels when you do that. Is sometimes the wheel... Like, depending on whatever my car layout is, like, I'm using the default blue and the default orange. Certain toppers and... Oh, 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 oh! Wait for it! Oh, and the biomass, is it certified? No. Oh well. Cool, I think that was my first black market uh, item out of this opening. Um, but depending on what the default car looks like, I mean, the wheels or the toppers can look better or worse, depending on the color of the car. So that's the only reason I'm kind of like, I may go through the toppers and you're like, oh, that topper looks like crap. But it actually doesn't look bad if you combine it with something else. Because I think pretty much any topper and any wheel can look just fine as long as you get the right colors on your car. Um, like, I've even used the Fez before a couple times and it looked pretty awesome. Um, the fruit cap. The, I mean, like I said, pretty much all of them do. As long as you use the right color combo on the car, it can look fine. Um, so I don't know, I mean, that's why I'm, like, if I do the toppers, some of them might not look that good, depending, and I'm not, I'm definitely not going to go through and be like, try to make a car that looks good with that topper. Um, not for, like, each and every single one of them, that would be insane. <clears throat> Come on, man, give me some painted stuff. I want those painted decals. Before I was thinking, ah, I'm not going to try to get the painted decals. That's crazy. Like, that, that's way too many. But now I'm like, eh, maybe, maybe. Painted! I think I already got this one now. This is orange. I think I got an orange earlier. Um. So now, if they are actually easier and they drop more, that means they'll be available more in the coming weeks. I probably will try to get all of them. Uh, I just won't go for them, like, super quick like I did everything else, though, because it's too much work. <laughs> Come on. Yeah, see, I don't ever really use the Takumi anymore. I use the regular one still, occasionally. I don't use the new one. Um, I don't know why. I don't care for the new one as much. That's why I'm hoping they go back on the original decals and redo some of those to be painted at some point. Um... How many is that left? 68 to go. Oh, my word. Um, one other thing I'll bring up, you know, if you're still with me, uh, if you haven't already turned this off. Oh, wait, 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 wait. We'll be right back. Let's see what this is for. Really? Another biomass? 
And it's not certified. Come on, man. So my second black market out of these 165 crates is another biomass. Um, what I was going to say, though, is in most cases, my videos are going to be fairly tame in terms of... I do have a bit of a potty mouth when I'm talking to people in real life, uh, as far as other adults. I am aware of the fact, though, that some of the people who are watching this are probably younger, so I am more careful with my words. Um, because if it were my kids watching this, I don't need them listening to someone who's dropping F-bombs and saying a lot of words like that. Uh, I am also cleaning up my comments when I have time, so if you curse in my comments, you know, I will most likely block you if you keep doing it. Um, and I'm most likely deleting your initial post if you say something like that. Because, you know, I'm trying to make it fun for everybody. And I'm trying to make it somewhat kid-friendly. Uh, I may make certain videos that are going to be more adult-themed at some point. Uh, in which case, you know, fine, let it rip. But I might make it to where you have to log on or something to be able to do something. <clears throat> um... I don't know, I haven't really thought about it too much, to be honest with you, but, like, one of the games I was going to do a quick video of, uh, Not a Hero, I wanted to do the first couple of levels of that game to show it off. I think it needs some attention, because I think it's a cool little game. It's a mature-rated game, so I really can't... I can't get out of that. I mean, it, it's a mature-rated game, what am I supposed to do? But I'm still going to watch what I say. Um, just because, yeah, I have my own kids, I would not appreciate them watching stuff that's not appropriate at their ages. Um, me and my wife are a little probably overprotective of our kids, but you know, it is what it is. You have plenty of time to grow up and enjoy adult things as you get older. So, because like my daughter's 14, she hasn't, you know, we don't let them watch R-rated movies yet. Um, he's, like I said, almost 12. Um... PG-13, pretty much almost anything goes, I would say. Certified. See, why can't... There should be an option on here to say what the certification is without having to actually leave the screen. Um, I don't know what else I was going to say. I'm tired, and this is taking much longer than I thought it would, and I don't feel good. I want to go get more orange juice. Um... I am not going to mess with this particular video. A guy had mentioned how my mic kind of sucks. I'm sorry for that, by the way. I'm using a very nice headset. It's the wireless Astro A50s. These are not cheap, but the mic does kind of suck. It's fine for uh, playing games and stuff. Hey, kiddo. What you doing? Certified. Let's keep going. Hold on, I'll be right back, people. And we're back. 58 more to go. I have no idea what I was talking about. Um, I don't feel good. I want more orange juice. I should have gotten it while I was up. But, oh yeah, the, the mic. The mic on these are not that great. Uh, I don't know why that is. You would think for a fairly expensive headset that the mic would be just awesome. It is not. <clears throat> but somebody in the comments on a previous video did recommend a program that oddly enough I had downloaded a while back. I just never used it. I uh, downloaded it back in October. I, I'm not even sure why. And it supposedly can help clear out like if there's some static and some other stuff in the background. I mean, I think they're fine uh, when you're talking to someone just playing a game or something. I've, I've a, a guy that I actually play with uh, has the same headset, and he sounds fine to me, but, um, you know, that's just playing a game, not trying to do, like, YouTube videos. Certified. So, I will not do that for this video, because I'm just going to finish this, upload it, and be done with it, but uh, for future videos, I will look into using that program and seeing, like, how easy it is to clean up the audio. Uh, 
50, 4, 2, go. Let's do this. Another Super RXT. No, I didn't want another one of these. Unless it's pain. And it's not. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Nothing. I'll take a tribal. If it's painted. <laughs> Nothing. <clears throat> Another distortion. But uh, I may actually do some other DLC if I do anything during spring break. Um, if I did like the Hot Wheels stuff like I was talking about. <coughs> Certified. Because um, I'm looking back at that list from when I, the Christmas one. I, I don't remember how much I gave away up until Christmas break. Or, you know, the, the 24th. But... Like that day, yeah, I gave away, it looks like three of everything, except for like Supersonic, I gave four, Back in the Future, I did five, Batmobile did five, Aftershock was four. Um, so I may do some more regular DLC as well. Um, especially if there's like a Steam sale coming up for Spring Break, uh, I may buy some while it's on sale, and then do something over Spring Break when I have time. Certified, come on, man. You know I don't care about certified items. I want, I need my painted items. Ugh. Wow, this is taking so much longer than I thought it would. And I am fading very, very fast. <clears throat> Oh, and one more thing. Um, I don't normally add people off of YouTube. Uh, I may here and there, like especially if somebody's saying, hey, I'm in the star rankings, I'll play with you. <clears throat> but one thing to note is my name that y'all are seeing pop up down there where it's like some random dude. No, that is not my Steam name. Um, and obviously if you go look up on Steam, some random dude, there's a ton of them out there. Uh, I use a different name, um, which wouldn't be very hard to figure out. Um, main reason I do not put, at least at the moment, my Steam name on there is because I don't want a whole bunch of people randomly adding me. Uh, because, you know, I've had people on Reddit and some other places say, like, hey, you know, would you give me this, give me this? Like, no, I'm not going to just give away the stuff that I worked to get myself. Um, if I do giveaways, that's different, obviously. But otherwise, like, don't just add me to say, hey, can you give me some free stuff? <clears throat> be happy to play with people. That'd be great. Um, you know, like I said uh, in previous videos, like, basically kids get first dibs if I have duplicates. After that, I may give some stuff away to some friends. And then after that, what comes next is, yes, I would do a Reddit giveaway or something like that to give everybody the chance to get some free stuff. <clears throat> come on, man. Oh, come on. Come on. Give me painted. 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 Wow. It's like when I actually do that, it works. <laughs> I need a little, come on, give me another one. Let's, let's do this. The power compels you. 
And nothing. There's no pain inversion with these. Although I actually would not mind painted variants of distortion since you're limited to the main primary color and then that black color. I think that would be kind of cool if they had like a painted variant of that. <clears throat> Although if they were going to do that, why not just allow you to use the secondary color, right? Nothing. 39 to go. We're almost there. Stay with me, people. It's going to be all right. And unfortunately, because these are kind of a rehash of existing items, they're just not as exciting either. I mean, it's really the decals are the only thing new. Um, and the fact that they're painted and all the rest of the, well, the distortions uh, for those cars. But otherwise, it's like, yeah, the cars, the wheels, the universal, it's been there, done that. So here's hoping that a CC5 or something new new will be out somewhat soon. Yes! Painted and certified. Looks like crimson. I almost kind of wish the distortions were at the lowest tier to where you could, uh, you know, trade up to one of the five other ones to possibly get a painted variant that way. That would be kind of cool. Nothing. <coughs> Maybe I'll get a painted Zomba. Come on. Painted. 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 Nothing. No, I don't think I've gotten one painted wheel. Uh, think about it. I haven't gotten, yeah, a Zombar Lightning that's painted. Which, not too surprising, those are fairly rare. But with this many crates, you would think the possibility would have been there. I mean, heck, one of my first crates ever was... Uh, It was uh, some lightning or something uh, that I opened, and I want to say it was purple, maybe? I don't remember. But it was something that was pretty coveted at the time. Come on, funny. Obviously not going to be funny. Certified. And let's see if it's certified. What do you know? Man, I need to just call it every time. And I'm sore, too. That's the thing that sucks. You know what's the worst? Is when you get a cold and it's hot outside. I don't know why that bothers me so much. When it's cold outside and you have a cold, it's not the end of the world. But when it's hot outside and you go out and get in the sun, uh, it's like absolutely horrible. I hate it. And it's hot here, so that sucks. I mean, here we are, you know, a little past mid-February, getting toward the end of February, and it's 80-something degrees outside. What the heck? <clears throat> Painted! I can't tell what color that is, actually. I think I'm going to end up some duplicate painted uh, decals out of this. Cobra Kai! Come on, give me something good. Nothing. 29 left. Oh, they're painted in the window. I didn't even notice that. And I was just talking about purple lightnings. That's funny. <laughs> Boom. Purple lightnings. That is funny. I didn't... For some reason, I don't remember that. That you could see the painted before it actually came up. <clears throat> well, that was interesting. I'm sure I knew that. I don't know why I don't remember it, but... 
Daffy. Yeah, some other videos I'm considering making are um, stuff based on uh, was certified. The like some emulators that I'm using for like Super Nintendo, uh, GameCube, all that stuff. Basically, every system up until the latest ones. Um, even the Wii and the Wii U can be emulated now, which is kind of surprising that the Wii U's already emulated. Nice painted. It's just a shame that I'd never use this car. Um, I don't know. And like I, I th said, I ugh, said this before on another video that I will probably do some stuff on some uh, indie games. What I would refer to kind of as indies. Maybe ones that weren't as big of a hit, but they're pretty cool. Certified. <coughs> All depends on when I have time. So, because if I wasn't home today, I would not be doing this, and... I want to go back to bed right now, actually. I tell the kids to make their own dinners tonight, and make dinner tomorrow night. <coughs> here because if my kids see me on here that's not very fair because they're not allowed to get on electronics on school nights whoops so I usually try not to get on my computer uh, unless I'm working until after they're in bed on school nights anyway <clears throat> and I usually have stuff to do anyway we have chores and all sorts of crap around the house that needs to be done all the time much we got left. We got 19. We can do this almost there. I'm dying, but I can make it. I need to go look at these, the, the funny book. Painted ones on a maybe with a different background color to see if the color shows up a little bit better because those dots are so tiny that at least the ones that showed up earlier on that blue, you can barely see it. <laughs> Drum roll, please. I could get my son in here with his little drum set, and he could do a drum roll for me. That would be cool. Come on. Paint it, paint it, paint it. Nope. Certified. Ah. Uh. Ding, 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 ding. Come on. Nothing. Be kind of cool if they show the decals that are painted right here that you could tell, like, oh, you're about to get, like, an orange or something like that. Kind of like that I saw the wheels earlier when we saw the purple lightnings. I'm sorry, full tanks. 
I don't think I'm ever going to be able to embrace the new name. I'm still going to call them Lightnings. Another certified. Video is going to be like an hour long. Come on. Ah, distortions. Like I needed another one of those, right? Happy though, I got several painted decal ones. That was pretty nice. And two, what, biomass, I think? And I'll be able to give some of this stuff away, hopefully, on Reddit. But like I said, if, however, if I'm gonna give away items, I'm gonna have to find a middleman who's willing to basically take care of it for me. Uh, which I, I think on Reddit they will do that. Um, because, yeah, I'm not going to try to meet up with people and get the timing and everything of that done. It's like, I just want to hand them all over to someone else and let them say, here's a, a giveaway. You know, give a number between one and a thousand if you want, you know, some plain lightnings. Give a number between whatever and whatever for this and so on. Six remaining. Another one? Come on. That's a lot of distortions. I mean, I think it's kind of hilarious that, you know, in the older crates, I would have been annoyed had I gotten a whole bunch of the lower end decals, and now that's all I really want. <laughs> I'm like, no, give me the worthless stuff in the crate. That's what I want. I keep getting this second tier crap. I don't want more distortions. Almost there. What is this, the last one? Maybe there's one more after this? And then I'll do a quick run through to see what I got. Hmm. Alright, either give me something cool black market wise or give me a painted decal that I don't already have. Let's make it happen. Wishful thinking. Painted. Painted. You're probably going to give me a uh, tribal. That would be very nice. Come on. Come on. Painted. Painted. And disappointment sets in. Alright, so let's go to the... Wow, I got a lot of Octane ZSR. See, I'd be happy to give away some of these. That'd be cool now. Regular Tribal, you got Goalkeeper. You got Score in Crimson. Sniper. Burnt Sienna. And another Crimson. So that kind of sucks. I've got two Crimsons. One of them's certified. Um, uh, what else? Let's go to... Why is it showing... Oh, all the distortions. 
Two more biomass. Why are they not together? Maybe because they're in different crates? That's odd that they would separate them. Well, let's go up to the, to the breakouts. Got a lot of those too. Distortions, jugglers. Got a crimson funny book. A orange, gray, and another orange. This one was a sweeper. Doms. Lots of distortions. Unmasked crimson, saffron, and sky blue. Overall, not too bad. I can't complain. Oh, I forgot about this Kumi. Uh, what did I get on here? A gray, and I had the lime already before I started all this. And... Forest green, and then I've got two oranges. What did I get on the wheels? Oh, those were the, um... I got... See, it's odd that they're not together. Oh, it shows it's because it's in a different crate, that's why. Duh. I mean, they are identical, right? There's no difference whatsoever. Kind of odd that they would still keep them separated instead of having the two on top, but... Uh, there's... Something else? Um... Zombas. It must be a Zomba. There you go. Yay! Alright, well there you go, folks. 165 crates. Um... What did I get? Two biomass. Saw the painted items, or the painted decals, and some of these that are uh, certified. I will probably do a giveaway during spring break for the uh, Hot Wheels DLC. I'll most likely do it on Reddit, unless someone has a better idea. Like doing it over Twitch, or if, if it's somehow possible to do it over YouTube, I'm not sure. <clears throat> I mean, I guess I can always make a video, have people comment on there, but... Reddit just seems easier to me. Um, and then I may also give away items if I can find a trusted middleman to hold the items and actually hand them out to people. Um, anyway, until next time, guys. It's been fun. Uh, I will not do another crate opening again unless it is a brand new crate with all new items, so it's a little more exciting. Uh, take care.